Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to another episode of Peace of Mind. And this week I want to get started with modded Minecraft because, you know, we've we done a lot of this stuff. We've done the basics, apart from the fish one, which, I don't know, that just does my head in. So we haven't done that yet. Peaceful recipes, we've done everything apart from the shulker shell because I um, haven't got any chorus fruit. Farming and cooking, there's only a couple of things left in that. Tinkering away, I went to um, two different slime islands to get the slime saplings. So at some point we will do that. Decoration station, we've done everything except all the hangy things. It's like, I don't want to make 101 different fairy lights. Sorry. <laughs> um, the little things, we've completed that one. Modded Minecraft this is what we need to open up the second part of the book. We did Doggy Talents, we finished that last week. But we've got Roots, we've got Rustic, Immersive Engineering, which I'm currently going through in my um, Automaton series. So you can see all the hilarity that ensues if you have a look at that series. Astral Sorcery, which... I've never really done in any kind of depth. I know it's there, but, you know, never really done it. Uh, Batania, I've done basic things, but nothing brilliant. I mean, I've done, like, the flowers and made the wand of the forest and a mana pool, and that's it. But, um, yeah, haven't done much. Extra Utilities too. I have done the Creative Flight thing, which is awesome, but it involves a lot of work and then advanced storage which looks like it is uh, I should know what this is because it's got the chips and stuff I can't remember but the advanced storage oh it's refined storage okay yeah there you go I knew I knew it but refined storage is pretty cool but you need to have done energy energy generation which I think comes under oh I think it comes under immersive engineering it's one of these uh, no but it's one of these other tabs that we need to have done so we need to open up the second part so in order to do that we need to do some of we need to do these things because they're all standalone, but it's all um, they're all gateways to the second half of the book. So I thought we might as well go through it, and we'll start off with Roots, which I have never really used. I've seen it in other mod packs, but I've kind of like, meh, not interested. But we need to at least start it. So um, I started looking at what we needed to get for the book. Wrong thing. Right, so if you do at roots and you need the natural arts book, which involves moon glow leaf, which I have no idea where you get that, or runestone, terra moss, I'm hoping it's in the book of herb lore and the book of spellcraft. Because they show you the, the stones here, but when you click on it, it doesn't really give you a recipe. So I'm guess I'm hoping it's in these two books. So we need to make these two books. And in order to make these two books, you need a birch bark tome and um, a flower, feather, ink sack. That has to be a dandelion. Okay, but the top can be any flower. And the spellcraft, the bottom has to be mutton. The top has to be fermented spider eye. I have no idea how you make that, but I'm sure we'll find out. Oh, spider rice, sugar, and mushroom. Okay. But we need a birch bark tome. You need birch bark and a piece of leather. And to get birch bark, you need to make a knife. So you have a wooden knife, you have a stone, you have iron, uh, you have diamond, and you have golden. 
So I went ahead and made a diamond knife. And it looks like a little dagger. And I do know that in order to get the barch off the tree, you will cut down the tree. Um, as if it were, you would use the knife as if it was an axe. And I tried it on a, with a wooden knife and an oak tree. And it worked. I have 11 pieces of oak bark. But you need birch for the book. So we are going to go looking for birch trees. I didn't think I'd actually be saying that because I know birch is not a favourite tree of a lot of people. But we need a birch tree. And we have a birch tree right here. So if I hold down for um, excavation or excavation, so at least I cut down the whole tree. I've got everything. Bit of birch leaves up here. But out of that, we got 58 pieces of birch bark, almost a stack. And not very much durability used up on the knife. So that's fine. We need some flowers. Ah, uh, Poppy. I'm guessing it uses van vanilla flowers. And not any of the flowers that are in that are from other packs. But one of them had to be no not that. Herblore. You need a dandelion. Are those dandelions over there? There might be. With the slime the slimes for the the um under the Tinkers tab, you need to have, you need to go to Slime Islands. One of them is in the Nether, and the others you can see all over the world up in the sky. Not seeing any dandelion. Oh, there's one. There you go. Did we get it? Yes, we have it. Right, let's go back. So you'll probably see on my mini map that I have a, a, a marker for a purple slime island. Because you also need purple slime to make um, night slime. Which I haven't started. I've just gotten the purple liquid slime for it. But I didn't start it as yet. Okay, we need two pieces of leather. Oh, am I full? Still full. Um, congealed magma slime block. I put the magma slimes in um, two hopping bonsais. Bonsai, sorry. So you get slime balls, slime slaplings, leaves, and congealed slime blocks. So I'll probably just let it fill up once and then... I won't need any more other after that. Um, I really should open those birds' nests. They are useful sometimes. Uh, what else do we need? We need to put away this basalt. I mined it in the nether so that I can make a bridge. What's that? Oh, that's ash block. I could make a bridge over to the the Magna Slime Island. But when I'm finished um with the with the roots the the little bit that we need to make the roots books, then I will go into the nether and show you guys what the slime island looks like. So we need a birch bark tome. I picked up didn't I pick up leather? Did I put it back? I must have put it back just now. Uh, birch bark. We need two. And then the herb law. Oh, we need an ink sack and a feather. Alright, let's go and kill... Let's go kill a squid. There's lots on that side.
right some ink sacks I think we got some calamari out of that too yes we did and we need feathers I must have feathers up in the I must have feathers somewhere if not we'll have to go and kill a chicken um, again this is where we start searching oh there's feathers in this in this um I'm just about to call it a tray it's not a tray chest in that chest right herb law so we have that let's have a quick look and see what it has in it um within this tome is contained the ancient art of herb law it can bears a listing of the great mystical herbs their properties and a description of their synthesis under the moonlight okay Oh, oh, there's the rune stone. Blued, blued stone forged by throwing stone into the central symbol of a moonlight circle. Okay, what's a moonlight circle? Circles of mossy standing stones may be found. Uh, what? Okay, the thatch we've seen moonlight circle okay is that anything I can see on the map oh you know what I did see one I did see one but I can't remember where Um, did see one. I think we may have been there on camera. Um, here, somewhere out here, I think. On the way to here. Oh, that's going to bug me now. That is definitely going to bug me. But I think somewhere in this field, maybe. But you must be able to find them easily if they're saying that you've got to find it and use it. Okay, I'm going to have to go and have a look off camera. But I'm pretty sure it was around this field because I'm pretty sure we stopped and I pointed out the thatch and stuff for the roots mod so we'll have to go and have a look at some point okay so that means then um moon glow grown under moonlight so oak leaves birch Oak leaves, birch leaves, oak sapling, birch sapling, and white tulip. But I don't understand. Um, is this in a in a moonlight circle? I don't. I don't. Un do you need a special all right I don't know if you need a, sp a special table what's the other book this book we can't oh this is the spellcraft it might be explained in this okay fermented spider eye is sugar spider eye and mushroom do we have that upstairs in our pantry do we have any spider eyes? I'm pretty sure we had to make some for um, our recipes. That might be downstairs. Do we have any sugar? All right, let's have a look over here. Sort by name. As what, raw bacon? 
rice cake, salt, slime, scrambled eggs. No, we have no sugar, but I'm pretty sure we have um, sugar cane downstairs anyway. Let's see if we have any fermented spider eyes. Uh, not in there, not in there. Yes, there's one in here. There's a spider eye. Do we need a brown mushroom? Because we have red mushrooms in here. And we have some sugar cane in here. Um, get rid of the flowers. Okay. Spellcraft, fermented fur. Uh, it's saying that we need brown mushrooms. Okay. We can do brown mushrooms. Um, sugar cane. It's... Okay, um, I think there's brown mushrooms out here somewhere. I think in a cave entrance. It's a cave entrance somewhere around here. And the thing is, I've passed them so many times, I can't... Oh, great, rain. Yeah. Where's the cave? Um... Oh, this is annoying. This is very... An oh, no. Yes, maybe. No. Um... Okay, we have a ravine down here. I'm just going to jump in. you got to love those feather fall boots. They're pretty cool. Oh, fish. I'm full. Um, uh, where's my feed bag? Um, mushrooms. I'm sure I've seen mushrooms in the entrance to a cave somewhere. Right, I was going this way towards here. Oh, this has to be under that dungeon place. Nothing of interest, really. No. Okay. Um, I didn't realise there was a rabbit. No, I think I might have seen it once and then promptly forgotten about it <laughs> behind the house. But not seeing any mushrooms here. So I think what I will do then is I will go off camera, oh, that's slate, go off camera, look for those standing stones because I've seen them, I've definitely seen them and then when I come back onto the camera, onto the camera, that's a bit, when I, <laughs> when I find them I'll come back on camera. When I come back onto the camera, that ju that just sounded weird. Uh, let's teleport home. Let's drop off some stuff. But I will be back after I find some stuff. Okay, I found the standing stones. I was right. It was next to 
I can't see where the bone block is because it's it's raining. But it was where I'd found the um, the roots hut. So you've got these mossy stone stones in a circle, but I'm not sure if this is how it's supposed to be. I think the two structures may have generated into one. But now I know what we're looking for. I will have to have we'll have to keep an eye out for it. But um so yeah, so that's that. Still haven't found any mushrooms, which is really annoying. I'm finding biomes of plenty mushrooms. But no normal normal mushrooms. So um I'll have to keep checking caves and stuff between here and home and see if I can find any because I am not finding any and I bet you when I don't want them I'll be finding loads I'm sure there was some in a cave behind our house it was right in the entrance but I don't know but the thing is it didn't if I I didn't know that's what those structures were otherwise I would have marked them on the map where is home by the way uh, home is that way okay but I would have marked them on the map as being useful but it was just to me it was just randomly generated things so um, okay so like I said now I know what we're looking for I will keep an eye out and again I will be back once I found some mushrooms are these didn't I just see mushrooms yeah the biomes are plenty mushrooms once I find normal mushrooms then I will be back so we can make that um, second book I didn't think it was gonna be so much faff otherwise I don't know I didn't think it'd be yeah I didn't think it'd be that so much of a pain to find everything okay guys I will be back okay it was literally as soon as I stopped recording um, went under a tree in the forest and I found some mushrooms which is how it usually is right so we have that we have I put everything in my backpack so we need the birch bark tome we need the spider eye. Um, we need a feather. Oh, we're over there, and we need ink. Did I put the ink upstairs? Because it's not in the backpack. I might put the ink upstairs in the food yeah there you go and feathers were in here need another feather okay take that out fermented spider eye and spellcraft I oh, know we need the pig. The pig keeps us fed. Okay, um, spellcraft spells can be cast. No, there's a mortar, herbal pouch, staff, imbuer, spell creation. No, that's a mortar and pestle. That's not the same thing. That's not the same thing. Okay. Now that is annoying. I can't believe how much faster ender, ender pearls grow on endstone. Because on the grass they just took forever. And on this it's like, woo! Two seconds later and they're fully grown. Did we get any um, 
Oh, we got some more ender lilies. Okay, I guess this means then I'm going to have to look for another um, another set of standing stones, moonstones, whatever they are. But I don't think it's anything that you can see on the map, which is really annoying. I might have to I might have to go into creative and just fly over because I mean it's pretty much like looking for a needle in a haystack because if we didn't have if we didn't find the fortress if we weren't looking for the fortress we wouldn't have found those standing stones so and like I said they're not easily seen on the map it's nothing that you know you could look at the map and say well that looks like it might be them over there let me mark it and go and have a look so that's a pain hmm that really is a pain because I just wanted to do the books so at least that tab was open and we have the option of that tab being open. But, um, yeah, I'm just going to be wandering, wandering aimlessly through the landscape <laughs> until I find another set of those, those mossy stones in a circle. Unless you always find them near to a roots hut, I don't know. Those fairies, that's a thing. Is that roots? I don't know. I just saw the fairies, like lights. Uh, let's go back up here. No, it's not there now. There were like lights right here by those trees because I was looking at the immersive engineering house because you know it's an immersive engineering house because it has a, a hammer engineer's hammer over the door and then the crates on the inside usually have lots of immersive engineering stuff and also very handy the crates can be used as portable storage because th when you break them they retain whatever's in them but I'm going to leave these here for now. Is there another standing stone maybe? What? Bri Brer Brerder. But yeah, that is annoying. So maybe I should be looking out for a roots hut. Maybe they're close to Roots Huts. I don't know. Ooh, hello lady. Oh, this is Bailey from Bailey's Dailies. I'd forgotten about that. Where we can have the um, the daily tasks and get emeralds and things. Well, this is annoying. And now we're in the desert. We have an oasis here. That's from um, uh, Biomes of Plenty. So you can get jungle wood, cocoa beans, that kind of thing. So yeah, I'm going to have to do a lot of exploring. Tumbleweed, anything of in oh, her bone. I was hoping for a diamond. You can find diamonds in tumbleweeds, which is cool. But yeah, I'm going to have, to, I think. Well, actually, we could always try that now. Just going into creative just to see if we can find um, those standing stones. Because 
they're not very pre prevalent in the world. And I really don't want to finish the episode until I find it. So, uh, game would help if I could spell game mode creative. Right, let's have a quick look. Oh, that was um from the 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 pay. Where's home? Home is that way. Let's try going this way, away from home. Why do things keep? Why does the sky keep blacking out like that? It's a bit random. It's like wood, like shadows, but there's no clouds in the sky, so I don't know. But we will have a little bit of a look. Because like I said, there's not, it's not even as if these structures, structures are common and that you can find them all the time. There's a roots. Is that roots thatch? Yes. No. What's this? Yeah, this is a roots hut. Because it's got the thatched roof. Um, oh, okay. Ah, it would have a witch in there. Nice stuff. Oh, mana steel. Nice. Battalia. Okay, I have no idea what this is. I have no idea. Okay, let's have, let's go up a bit more. There, there's another one. Except that. No, maybe that's how they are. Maybe they're all, um, because there's another roots hut. Yeah, different book. Lexica Britannia. Oh, good, because we'll need that later. Or well, maybe these aren't root huts, then. Maybe these are um, uh, Britannia huts. Okay, let's see if we can find one more stone circle. Because that one's incomplete. But if we find another one and it's like that, well then at least we know, well okay, this is, this is how it's supposed to be. And I've come to the edge of the world. Okay. I think that's a sign. We're not supposed to be doing this. Is this chunk not loaded properly? Oh, there you go. Okay. I thought we were going to fall off the edge of the flat, the fall off the edge of the turtle. Okay. Wait, what? What on earth is that? Wow! I have never seen anything like that. But there's a lot of stuff down there. Um, we got some pets. Got an emerald. What pets did we get? Oh, we got a blaze pet. And, okay. Nice. Alright, let's just see if we can find one more thing. There's an astral sorcery temple. And there's another hut. Do we have a 
Do we have any circles nearby? We have this. I think this was supposed to be a hut. Or maybe supposed to be... Um, I don't know. All right, let's switch back to um let's switch back to survival. Game mode survival. No. I thought I pressed S. All right, now we're back in survival. We have our pick. Is this thing? Wow. Zombie. I'm guessing this is some kind of dungeon. Okay. Um, put stuff in the backpack. I guess this is like some kind of catacombs or something. Uh, catacombs. Okay, well, I'm going to leave... Oh. You're, um... You're a sprout. I don't know what you want. There's more sprouts. You look very happy, Sprout. And you know what? We should have marked the other two, um... The other two root huts. Or sorcery huts, or whatever they are. More mana steel. Okay, I am going to have to have a look. Did that make sense? I think that made sense. <laughs> I'm going to, going to have to have a look and see what I can find in terms of um, moonlit circles or moonlight circles or whatever sorcery circles they are. <laughs> because, or we might have to leave it and do one of the other tabs because we did get a Britannia com completed because we got the Lexica Britannia. So we might have to leave roots for now. Astral Tome. What do we need to make an Astral Tome? Um, aquamarine, books and parchment. Okay. Where's the Astral Sorcery place? Because I know we can get parchment there it is if we just look under the columns one of them at least with the smaller astral sorcery stuff one of them you will get a a chest with stuff in it and the aquamarines, the blue um, gems, you get that in water. So yeah, I'm going to have to do a bit of a search off camera. See what I can find. And I think we're going to have to leave that for a little bit and do the other, the other bits in, in that tab. So we can do the astral sorcery. Hopper ducks. We could probably do the hopper ducks next week. And ceramics. So at least we can do those. And what's this one? Magical sigh. I have never heard of that. So 
yeah we'll have to do that as well but this is where we're going to leave it here so thanks very much for watching please like comment and subscribe because your comments really mean a lot to me you guys have a lot of tips and tricks that I didn't know and I'm learning a lot and I will see you guys in the next episode so thanks for watching bye bye